wikidonis.com truth about tooth hi i'm dr thomas nichipadam from nichipadam dental at marine drive today i'm coming with another interesting topic on how to choose the right dental clinic yes this is global times we travel from different countries i personally have 60 countries uh, citizens who have come and treated with me but let me tell you how you can choose the right dental dentist see you may be a global citizen you may be a globe trotter but how to choose a right dentist is another big issue because you might think you might go to the the nearest dentist the nearest dentist might be a uh, expensive might be not expensive may may have the skills may not have the skills so you need to understand what are the skills required for your treatment so you, this is global times and you're watching me on youtube that means that you are digitally friendly so you should always look for his reviews on den, on dentistry how how he has treated patients how good he is you should ask some of your colleagues who have gone if it is your neighboring area or you can just go to google you can search some of the f- people who have reviewed just ask them a little bit of questions if they ask and answer you please go and visit that dentist why i tell you because is because there are lots of packages for dentistry there are lots of treatments which is there there are sometimes just like banks you might have some hidden charges also because sometimes they tell okay what is the treatment for a crown what well, this is the treatment for the what is the charge for a crown so they will tell you okay this is the charge for the crown then they will start charging you for the temporary crown they will charge you for the preparation of the crown they will charge you for the impression separately if they charge for uh, other amenities which you have used like sterilization and things like that then your charges are going to rise so especially in the pricing part please ask before you start any treatment otherwise you are price limit might go please take a package before especially for those people who are coming from abroad to india please don't uh, get into a treatment just be- before you ask the price and ask for check for the packages because that is the most important thing which actually breaks the relationship or because you are spending big money most of the time because you have traveled all the way you might have be doing an implant you might be doing some larger procedure so that is the first thing i'd like to talk to you about choosing the right dentist now the second part is choose the right dentist with the skills why the skills is very important because you will not go to the local uh, doctor for your pregnancy you might go to a, a right gynecologist for that like that even in dentistry we have specialists for each and e- each and everything i i don't rely on any anybody less than a periodontist to do a periodontal surgery but maybe some simple procedures like fillings and things like that can be done but when it comes to large work please go to the expert who has the expertise who has the experience and who has the right the way of thinking to do your treatment please ask them to show some of the profiles of the patients which has been treated by them not by just we are taking from somebody and showing it to you please ask them how what what is the treatment and what is the plan which you have and please look into it that they have time to explain you each and every procedure so that you will get the right treatment what you expect uh, from them before and one more thing is actually you should look for the sterilization protocol because that is what which will give you other infections if you have gone with a dental infection or dental treatment but you might get other infections like hepatitis or aids from a dental clinic also because if it is not the right disinfection and sterilization protocol you might get uh, other infections from dental clinic and now it is corona time and we use a lot of uh, stuff to disinfect and things like that but the dentist is the most prone to get all these infections so we need to protect ourselves and also protect our patients from this thing so sterilization protocol is very important the third the the greatest thing is actually to protect our mother earth or the nature because if at all the dentist is going to just throw all the stuff to the drain and if the infection is going to go to the next door neighbor or if it is going to uh hurt the rest people if if the whole infectious stuff is actually thrown out and if it is not been treated properly then you are actually going to disturb the whole system so you will not see the dentist again after some time so if you are if you are going to such a dentist then 
what happens is he will destroy the nature, he will destroy the neighbor, he will not be able to practice because he himself have dug the uh, grave for himself. So please make sure that you go to a dentist where the disposal of the waste is also proper and done according and properly. Because these are the things you should look because that is the way the treatment and the quality of it will be maintained by that person because you might think okay what is the problem with him disposing it somewhere else but uh, that is the, that shows his integrity that shows his quality of practice so please go to a good quality practice please ask people before you go there because the quality of the material which is there also determines the, the longevity of the treatment so please go to an expert a dentist please go to a good dentist with good quality materials who can explain you things and third and final whatever i'd like to tell you is go to a dentist who has time and who has enough patience to explain you especially if you're going with a smaller kid please go to a dentist who is actually very friendly with you because the child if it is the first especially if it is the first appointment please make sure that you go to with a child to a dentist who has time and uh, who has who is friendly because the first experience with the dentist determines how well the child adapts to a dental clinic and that is very important because otherwise the child will never go to a dentist again i have seen some some of the elderly patients who just went once to a dentist and then they neglected their teeth just because they scared, they were scared of what it. Odontophobia is a true uh, issue because that phobia has created many problems, dental problems, which can be treated very simply. But since they had a very bad experience, they never went to the dentist and they got into trouble. So please make sure that you, if you are going with a child to a dentist, if you are a mother or father of a child who is going to take the child to a dentist, please go to a dentist who is friendly, who has time to spend with the, with the child and explain things to her in her own language so that they, they will also feel that the dentist is okay and how uh, well she or he is behaving to them so that they'll have a rapport and they will never be scared of a dentist because uh, their experience was so good. So please make, look into all these points so that you will choose the right dentist so that you'll get the right treatment the right quality of treatment and also a very good experience so that you can have a greater better smile and better health because of having great teeth so all these things will count to uh, getting the right dental clinic i hope i have helped you if i have helped you please give it uh, share it to your friends on facebook or or on instagram or whatever social media you are in please send it to all the whatsapp groups and things like that so that they will also choose the right dentist and they will also have a great and better smile and they will thank you for that. Thank you. If you have not subscribed my videos, please subscribe my video. Press that bell button so that you will be uh, getting all the notifications for my videos. Thank you very much. I am Dr. Thomas Nechipadam from Nechipadam Dental at Marine Drive, Cochin. Cochin is a nice place. You are always welcome down to Cochin. If you are coming to Cochin, even not for... Uh, dentistry, you are always welcome to meet me and have a coffee with me. Thank you very much, Dr. Thomas Nichipada.